what do you guys think about doing an experiment with the silkworms? And what I mean by experiment, I mean, out of these large ones, how about we see how many can come out naturally, and of those ones that come out naturally, we breed them together, and we continue the cycle for the next year. And now that I already have these ones that should probably spin within the next week, so we'll have moths in two weeks, I already have the next batch going of 20. As you can see, they're super tiny, so it'll be about four weeks until the, these guys spin, but I was thinking that maybe we could see if there's a way that we could get a line of worms that can naturally come out on their own when they become moths. I thought that would be kind of neat. We will keep checking back periodically and see how this experiment goes. Another experiment I was thinking about doing, since I already know that I can work on their genetics and make them not as deformed and all that good stuff, what if we could also work on only breeding the moths that do the most fluttering and see where we get with that in the next year or so? Let us know in the comments what you think about the idea. I don't know. Gives us something to do.